This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at diamagnetism and paramagnetism. Diamagnetic materials have no unpaired electrons and are weakly repelled by a magnetic field. Paramagnetic materials have unpaired electrons and are attracted by a magnetic field. Here we have two examples. On the left we have helium, on the right we have lithium. Helium has the electron configuration 1s2. This means it has two electrons in the 1s sublevel. Lithium has the electron configuration 1s2, 2s1. It has two electrons in the 1s sublevel and one electron in the 2s sublevel. By looking at these electron inbox diagrams, we can see that helium has paired electrons, therefore it's diamagnetic. Lithium has an unpaired electron, therefore it's paramagnetic. Spinning electrons create a magnetic field. In paramagnetic materials, the spins of the unpaired electrons temporarily align with the externally applied magnetic field. The more unpaired electrons there are in the material, the stronger the paramagnetic effect. In diamagnetic materials, the paired electrons create a very small magnetic field in opposition to the externally applied magnetic field. This explains why paramagnetic materials are attracted by a magnetic field and diamagnetic materials are weakly repelled by a magnetic field.